hello guys welcome to my channel today i want to talk about the property price in zimbabwe property and land price the price is very expensive well i've been like watching this few youtubers that i watch on youtube yeah um, one of those youtuber is mr zim there's some others but that's the one i remember drive around or use the drones to show around the neighborhood in harare particularly me personally i want to be in harare because my in-laws are in harare so it just makes sense that i'm gonna be in harare i've been just looking for prices properties and land like just doing my own research to see what i want to do but like from what I watch from those videos, I don't know if he just because he just goes in a very expensive neighbor neighborhood that that's why the prices are so expensive. Me personally, I want to be in a low density area. Uh, my mother in law's house is in Rua, and I asked, and apparently it's not low density as such. So she's like a mid density. I don't know. Yeah, um, but I would like to be in a low density and somewhere not too far from the city also. Uh, because last time I was there driving from Mura to like Harare was oh my god when there's traffic you could spend two hours on the road and it wasn't pleasant at all and I hate driving long distance and uh, with the heat it doesn't help so I'd rather be somewhere that's that's not too far from the city but the price is oh my god I, okay 10,020 I'm not too fussed about that that's okay but going to 50,000, 100,000, 120,000 for, 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 for a piece of land. I don't know if it's even a thousand square meter. Like, I'm like, what? How am I going to afford that? I, I don't know what to do. I'm a bit worried. I mean, obviously you can stay with family for a little while, but after a while you want to have your own place. You want to build your own place so if it's going to be that expensive i'm starting to worry like can i afford it people say there's no money in zimbabwe people say the economy is bad in zimbabwe but people have money to spend on peace on land like that that much money to spend on land to spend on properties to buy really really nice cars it makes me question like hmm Another thing I would like you to give me advice on are schools. Um, so I heard there's a good private school in Zimbabwe, but in Harare. But I don't want like those crazy amount that have crazy amount of school fees and blah, blah, blah. I run a good private school, preferably owned by a local Zimbabwean. But that's not crazy expensive, but has good result and good um, reputation. So if you have any advice on that, it will be very appreciated. I want to find out if there's anyone that's gone going through relocating from Zimbabwe who's not Zimbabwean. Um, how? What does he? What do you do with the immigration? Uh, if you want to have a resident permit, if you want to have a small business as a non-Zimbabwean, what procedure you have to go through? If you have any advice like what to tell me i need i really need a step-by-step -step, uh advice uh what i need to do if i have to start from here within the uk or i'll have to wait until i get there to do something um i'm not married to my partner don't ask me why we're not ready yet uh, what does that mean as a non-married couple i mean i have children with a zimbabwean man from my understanding, my children have can apply for citizenship since they, their father is from Zimbabwe, but I'm not married to their father. So what does that mean for me? Where do I stand? How do I get a permanent residency within Zimbabwe? And uh, also, how do I go about if I want to have like a small business in Zimbabwe? If you have any advice for all these questions, please tell me in the comment below because I really need advice. I really want to start planning now. I don't like leaving things mm -hmm. last minute, so I'm really doing my own research. If you have advice, how much was the average price to buy a piece of land in a low density area? 
what is the average price if you want to build a four bedroom bungalow um, property house so please tell me i need your advice um, on what to do thank you very much and uh, i'll see you very soon please like and comment and subscribe and uh, merci beaucoup à très bientôt passez une très 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 bonne journée une bonne soirée bonne journée alors non au revoir bye bye